this reading's from my fabulous Sagittarius's out there. So how I do my tarot cards is I shuffle them and then I spread them and then basically I choose the one that I feel I'm drawn to when asking a question. Hopefully this tarot reading will help and inspire you for the month of October and guide you through the right pathway. Of course it is a general reading but hopefully you'll find something that will help you. So the first question I'm going to ask is what the energy of the overall month is going to be. The second question I'm going to ask is what's your social energy the month going to be. The third question, what should you pursue in this month? Fourth question, what should I be, what should you be cautious of? My Sagittarius is. Number five, how can you practice self care? And number six, last but least, is how can I align with my higher self? These are the cards that have been chosen. How I work is I'll turn over the card and then I'll give you more information. So for the general energy for this month, you have got the Knight of Pentacles. I deserve financial security. Number two for your card, social life of this month. It's a nine of wands. I'm strong for as long as I need to be strong. Number three, what should I pursue this month? You have got the four of swords. I take time to recover my vitality. Number four, what should you be cautious of? The ten of wands. I love and care for myself first. Number five, how can I practice self-care? Nine of pentacles. I take time, I take the time I need to nurture myself that's an interesting one for actual self-care, isn't it? Um, number six, how to find alignment with my higher self. The moon. My intuition guides me to the right direction. I hope this tarot reading has helped my fabulous Sagittarius's out there and has guided you and maybe felt inspired and helped you along the path journey of October. And do let me know in the comment box if it has and how it's linked and see you guys later. Take care.